Well, good morning, all. It is great to have each and every one of you here with us. I've got some questions to ask. I want to know what you're thinking. So let's get started. First question, do you like ice cream? Yeah? Okay, next question. Do you like ice cream? Oh, I already asked that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let me try it again. Do you like ice cream? No. No. Not anymore. You gave up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'll change it. Do you guys like donuts? Yes. 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 Do you like donuts? Yes. No. Stop asking. Sorry. Sorry. I'm just stuck. On, I'm just stuck on repeat today. Is that I? I'm gonna give it a real good hard try. Do you guys like donuts? All right. Okay, okay. So you guys, you guys are responding pretty well today. It's kind, of, it's kind of a strange thing to have someone keep repeating themselves, isn't it? So in our reading today, though, we're going to hear Jesus ask the same question over and over and over again. He's going to ask that question of his follower. He's going to ask Simon Peter, He's going to say, Simon, do you love me? Simon, do you love me? Simon, do you love me? Now, is Simon going to get annoyed like you guys did? You're like, stop asking me that. Is that that how Simon responds? No, it says that Simon became very sad. Then why did Simon get really sad? Sad. Do you know? He thought that Jesus didn't love him. Is that what do you think? I, I know story yeah. So, um, Jesus is that Simon had denied, Peter had, Simon Peter had denied Jesus three times. And so what was Jesus reminding Simon of? That I know even your worst sins. I know the worst parts of your life and the worst parts of your story. But Simon Peter, do you know that I still love you? Do you know that? Do you believe that? That Jesus loves you. Even in the worst of times, Jesus is still there for you. So we're going to be hearing more about that in our sermon today as we celebrate that great, amazing, powerful, huge, big love of God. And so let's go ahead and fold our hands, bow our heads, and let's join together in a prayer. I invite you and the congregation to repeat after me. Dear Jesus, We thank you that your love has no end. You are with us in the best of times and even the worst of times. We rejoice in your love. Amen. All right, you guys can head on back as we now hear that very word from our Lord in John chapter 21.